We're in the hunter section and then we're going to go over my one of my main main classes gunslinger I opened up all the pages and added all the uh, tripods that I need to if you're playing a gunslinger This particular tripod that increases your attack speed is very important. This is so expensive when I played this game This tripod costed me 30,000 gold because I failed it like eight times So you see this tripod over here for agile shooting uh, it increases the distance But it's I didn't level it up so if Gunslinger happens to have an update where I can have additional skill points, I can put it to level 7 and get that agile shooting with the additional distance, which is nice, right? So I could do that. Same case for here. I leveled this up as well. The somersault shot, this increases the attack speed of the somersault shot, so you can actually go faster. Uh, you can actually maneuver a little faster than that. But these tripods are the things that you don't really look at. But these are the cool tripods that you can look at and invest into. Uh, now is that the time to invest into it and get it for free uh, and then you know all these particular handgun stuff is different so the one mistake I have kind of did was grenade is used as a DPS skill for TTH but I don't have a level 5 of neither of them so that's a mistake I did but I'm not interested in TTH anyway now going back here the main skills of gunslinger is let me go from the importance to less important sharpshooter is very sharpshooter is one of the most important skill that you should do and then the dual buckshot is the next important one leveled up to five and a semi-scaled ones is the the shotgun rapid fire if you don't use this skill you don't need to level it up but i would suggest to level this up if you're interested in pm because you never know yet still the pm3 shotgun rapid fire is actually good I also leveled up last request too. I have the cooldown. I have the two damage related ones, but I don't have the attack damage one was because I never used this before. So this is another mistake that I did. But I also have these two. I have the triple one, triple fire, and then I also have the double shot. But the reason why I have this is because what if last request gets buffed? If something gets buffed, you guys know what happens, right? Koreans FOMO too. When you get a buff, Everyone wants to buy that tripod and that tripod's price goes skyrocket from 10 gold to like 3,000 gold. I have seen this so many times. That's the point I'm trying to get across on many, 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 many videos. Now going for the rifle one. The rifle category, the most important skill that you should level up the tripod one is focus shot, but it's only two. This one is also can be used is quicker. So if you are slower due to no runes or due to less combat stats or due to no yearning or whatever the reason is instead of this particular tripod you can use the left one for faster finishers it's a big difference in damage but let's say for comfort you can actually use this too when i was talking about lance master way before if you have a tripod that is uh, divided in preference it is always good to have it than not having a choice of changing your tripod during a raid fight it is so good target down some people do use this, but I have no idea how this works. I never use it, so I just never leveled it up, but I should have, right? But I just decided not. And now we have the perfect shot. Catastrophe. This is actually a good, good example that I can talk about. Everyone used this tripod in the earlier time. The reason why? So look, I have one out of 18, right? So I, can, I have one tripod that I can uh, allocate somewhere, but I can't anymore because most people go 7m i have no tripods to put on anywhere since i have one tripod left over which most people do which most gunslingers do you put it up on the right one because why not it went from 120 percent damage to 170.4 that's huge this is actually crazy before the tripod change no one cared about this tripod after the tripod change I was like, uh, you know what, maybe I could use it. So I gave it this, right? After the tripod change, everyone's been using this. This, sh this shit went up from like 50 gold to like 1,500 gold. And it was 20% chance to land it. Uh, so if you're a gunslinger player, since I, can, since I actually play it, uh, this as a main, not an alt, uh, what I can suggest is when you have two pages, if you have one page, you're able to have all the rifle skills leveled up. And then you can also have another page open to finish up my shotgun skills. But Gunslinger, even if it's an ult, you always need to open one more page. Why? 
because you need you need this skill. The, we could call it life leech or something for on the quick step. Some people say ah, it sucks, whatever, right? But level five is thirteen point eight. Level one is five percent. <laughs> Some people in my chat always ask. Oh, it's like they always go, ATK, why is your gunslinger so fast? You don't even have any swiftness. It's because of this skill. It's because of this tripod. That's the secret. You need that tripod. Uh, I think that covers all the gunslingers that I can I can think of. Deadeye. There's not that many Deadeye players. This is an ult Deadeye that I have. Five threes. Deadeye is so simple. The enhanced weapon Deadeye. You don't use rifle skills at all in the first place. You have the shotgun rapid fire. You have the uh, the other shotgun skill, and then you have the last request, and then you have the other shotgun skill, the Q skill. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That's two pages. All your main DPS skills is complete with two pages. You're done. If you open up two more pages, right? If you open up one more page, one, two, three, four, and then five, and then six for distance. That's 18 total. But if you're a Deadeye main, some people go this particular tripod for a faster hit. Deadeye has the close range uh, DPS increase, this one. And then it also has this one here, the close range based. This one is based on if you're close, you do 50% additional damage, 50%. What's level one at? 25%, it's double It's double the damage on, on, the, on the pluses, right? It's 25 versus 50. At the, during the interview, if you're not used to this particular close combat gameplay, you have an option to go full range. That's what the uh, Deadeye Pro said, right? You can go full range if you want to. Yeah, yeah uh, someone in chat noticed the same thing. Cl G3 Clown Bingo, for example, or G2 even. If you have an option to have this tripod, why not? You have, you have additional tripods. So you have two pages. You have additional 12 tripods for you to choose. To level up on your own leisure same case for last request too sometimes this this one you stand still but this particular tripod gets you gets you dashing it it dashes you forward so you can use either too that's why you can level up both as well but if you're a handgunner on the other hand i don't know anything about handgunner i don't know which skills that they go for uh i never even researched it Dead eyes is super simple, so let's go over. Now, I apologize. I don't know much about artillerist, and my artillerist build is the firepower build. It is doo doo. Uh, this was an actual legitimate build before the artillerist update. This build was built uh, eight months ago, uh, and I never changed it ever since. But I looked at some of the tripods. So, tripod for my thought process on this was obviously the energy field one. And then you have your uh, the main DPS skill, damage. And then you have the other main DPS skill, damage one. I didn't level this one. And then you have the meter gain skill. Uh, and I also leveled up some of the level fives on this. So four, four, five. So going over again, uh, barrage build is pretty popular right now. And if you kind of look at it, some of the skills do have uh, meter gain, meter gain related stuff. My advice is I think you should look around skill and what tripods they're using and you should write down what tripods all the uh, top players use in Loa, and then just and then just transfer it over if you're uh, artillerist main and then i'm pretty sure it will take about four uh, three to four pages so uh yeah so i'm not I, my knowledge of artillerist is very very low so i can probably stop from here but my advice is you know check the tripods that they get and then uh, level the tripods based um, upon it. And then you look into more tripods. Like you, you kind of like highlight them, so see what they do. And then if you think if you think you have a slot, why not? Just get them up. We're at Scouter. So Scouter is one of my main mains as well. So I can pretty much go on details about this. It's just out. So tripod may be a little bit expensive for you guys, but Scouter only needs one, two, three. That's not even a page. If you want to add a little more, four, five, and six, and you're done. That's it. And one thing I kind of wanted to suggest is if you guys want to play AT Scouter and Scouter, I would suggest you guys to level up the AT Scouter related skills. Look at this. So I can actually play AT Scouter if I want to because I got the tripod here and I got the avalanche, right? 
And I also have the flare beam as damage related. I also got the baby drone. It's missing a couple of tripods, so I may have to level up some tripods, like one or two tripods, but I actually never bothered to actually level some of them up. The reason why I didn't level this up is, think about it this way. So uh, when I was leveling up tripods, if I know for sure, 100% I'm not going to use this, it's a waste of peons for me. I, I have one left too. I'm not even using one tripod. This particular skill over here, this one, you don't really need it because uh, battery, uh, when you transform into scout, when you play EL scouter, when you transform, you don't even use battery in the first place. So in this case, I leveled up the first tripod is very, very important because it gives you 52% shield for eight seconds. So when you transform back, I use my W skill immediately to get that 52% shield uh, total HP. And I attack and then I transform and get that 60% shield. So you're shielded the whole time. That's my uh, thought process on it. So Scouter is so simple on the tripod point uh, that uh, most people actually played Scouter in the past because you don't have to worry about tripods. He only needs three tripods. So like when they were working on it, they just go, okay, I just go three tripods. Okay, my build's done. That's what most people did. Sharpshooter kind of needs more than 18, but you're just limited to 18 if, if that makes sense. So there's Silver Master here, and then there's also Silver Master here, and there's also a Silver Master at the counter. And then I got Snipe, because Snipe's very important, and then your four main skills. You got, you got Snipe, you got Charging Shot, and then you have Sharpshooter, and then you have Arrow Hail. So these are all damage skills. So you have 1, 2, 3, uh, 4, 5, 6, and then you have 7, 8, 9, and then you have 10, 11, 12. So you have two pages already for just your main skills, just like the Deadeye, the dead, Deadeye shotgun skills. And then you have another page for your Silver Master gains, right? You have one, two, three. And then you have three more left, right? So since you have three more left, what would you do? You could put something like this particular skill, or you could use the uh, Distance Traveled. You can use the Blade Storm. If you happen to be playing Loyal Companion as well, they kind of take different tripods. You know, they take Arrow Shower, now, let me tell you a funny story. After the patch of the tripod, I was so happy about, oh, I want to try this. I want to try the actual solid sharpshooter because if you have the meter gain, if you have the cooldown and everything, your rotation is so solid. It's so fun. As you guys play me, uh, as you guys see me play the sharpshooter sometimes, it's just fun stuff. You know, I just have real fun with it. Uh, and it's because it's built properly. You need the tripods to be played properly. Uh, I can't stress that out enough. So don't be a bozo like me and prepare earlier and make sure you have all the skills up ready to set to go on your skill inventory, okay? With that being said, that covers up the hunter section now.